Hi, my name is Mia Manalo, and this is my book report for Power by Linda Hogan. Um, so to start off, Power by Linda Hogan is an incredible and moving story of forces beyond the human world, a story about the voice of Omishto, a 16-year-old young woman that is a member of the Taiga tribe in the Florida wilderness, mentally capable enough to report against the colonizing systems that hold her tribe away from their traditional ways. The author, Linda Hogan, has a significant relation to writing this novel due to her childhood. Linda Hogan, born on July 16, 1947, in Denver, Colorado. Her father is Chickasaw and from a recognized historical family, which makes her Chickasaw by descent. Since she grew up, she developed a strong bond with her family, especially with her father. Her novels explore the world of Native people and the environment from her own Indigenous perspective. Power is the third... <clears throat> Sorry. Power is the third novel she's written, and the story revolves the killing of a Florida panther, which causes Ama to go on trial. Linda Hogan explicitly states that this novel draws inspiration from the 1987 court case, United States vs. Billy, which infringed upon the political and religious sovereignty of Native Americans. The trial of Ama Eaton presents a conflict between Western and indigenous perceptions of identity. This novel was written in first-person point of view from the viewpoint and emotions of Omishto. The novel is categorized as young adult literature and was written to demonstrate the audience morals as well as represents Native Americans. She presents an incredibly convincing and moving portrait of Native American spirituality. Omishto makes the difficult commitment to live among the Taiga people and through her deeper understanding, she is able to see the world in a Taiga perspective, recognizing the origins of herself, the Taiga people, and accepting her identity as a Taiga. Thank you.